Y254. Imagine. Right, a very good evening to you once again and welcome to Entertainment Thursday right here on y 2 TV, your favorite youth channel. My name is Philine. You can find me at Philine Jean across all social media pages. And of course, the hashtag to get on as usual is y 2 updates. Now, I'm going to let you meet my panel, but not before I tell you what the show is all about. Now, we're all about turning topics, what's happening in Kenya and beyond. Who's doing what? We are just here for the sauce and the juice to have all that so stay here for the next 40 minutes we're going to be telling you what's happening in the entertainment industry right and for me for me to introduce my panel i'm going to start with the noise maker of the group as usual yes with your happy thoughts how is it no 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 <laughs> Yeah. Wow. All right. Yes. So, so, can you pass over the mic to him? Um, your mic. Did you just do yes. that? Yes. Right. the only general from Limbo and this is how we start our show. Kama kawa kama dawa. Moshe ne lazima to pick it. Umbe ya tunayo ya kutosha. All right. Sawa. And right after that, we have the sassy yes. Jesse. What's yes. up? Hi, 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 everyone. Mm -hmm. uh, Jesse, hapa kama kawaida. Um, Wasi guze remote. Situ ata tukienda break. Yeah, go back to Apple. Mm. Yeah, stay Apple there. Too. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> and I have the Mwangis. Yo, know, I go by the names the Mwangis, or you can call me Dennis Bob Miner across <laughs> all social media platforms. And it's Thursday, mm. watu ni wakati ya udaku. Yes. My mom is watching. Welcome oh. to the show. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so hi, Dennis's is mom. How you doing? And all the moms out there, yeah, welcome to the show. And of course, high schoolers, by the way, my schoolers. Hi, welcome home. <laughs> welcome <laughs> home. <laughs> That's a new year. What's wrong with these people? <laughs> all right, let's get started. Let's go back to our first story. Now, Kenyan rapper Calligraph Jones has agreed to go ahead and release a reggae song after he lost a dare on Twitter. A Twitter fan by the name Charles Wahinya asked Calligraph to name to name how many retweets it would take for him to release a reggae song. The OG went ahead and asked for 2,000 retweets, and just three days later, the tweet went viral and got over 3,500 retweets. And Cal he said he'll go ahead and deliver because he's a mind of his word. All right, so OG, now you guys wanna I can't imagine this. Let's go to more fire, yeah. Bo 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 bo. Calligraph joins in the like what? I cannot even imagine what that song is gonna be like. But Mwangis, we don't even go with the cards. Yes, I am. I am now calligraph on the tune, yo. Boom boom. You don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a marathon. What I'm gonna do is do calligraph and I'm gonna do a marathon. Seriously, I love when they're cutting. You know. I play again. Yeah, you know, I come from Kiyali, yo. You know, you know what I'm saying. You know, 1960, yo. Rapping 1960. Yeah, yeah. But it's good. It's good. What's up? What's up? What's up? Mm -hmm. It's good. He lived up to his promise, and mm -hmm. whatever he said, he's gonna do. Right. And actually, it's. I talk on a dem flani piyave for the same thing. I mean, it root of from social media. Yeah. Yeah. So it's good. Social media. Na ata we have a look. Ita na kukuta na mimi. Ena social media. Right, this year, me and if at all, at always a part of your vibe, a urege, uras. No, but I think it's good to get like another side of him because you know, yeah, yeah. being an artist is all about that. Trying new things, different things. Reggae is mostly about love and peace, peace, yeah. See about you know, but it's good. He's kept his promise. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Tuone mata chafu. Kamati ya ro chafu. What do you have to say? Calligraph stick to your lane. Baki tuna hizo vitu na impanga. Tulakini wacha kuingia reggae. Juhu nyewe, ukichumizo tu reggae wengi yaona matatu. Lakini ya meka too much of tatu mbaka inabaki tukisema hini. 
Ini le billboard tunaangalia anga manini. Gosh. No mimi na sende tu calligraph. Calligraph. Please umepotea. Gosh. Tafuta njia nyingine. But it, he did not say he wants to do reggae. Mtu alimdea. Alimchallenge. Alimchallenge ni aje. So any artist unaweza imba. Imba reggae tukuheshimu. It's a high time calligraph acha kusikiza watu. Enda na roho yako. Unapotea. I am full. Thank you so much to everybody who's watching. If you want to be part of the conversation, just uh, you can tweet and talk to us at Philinjin at White Fair for Channel, and of course the hashtag is White Fair for updates. Right now, let's move on to another story. Now, infantry soldiers in truck in trucks took over security in areas of Likoni for the entire day during Mashuja Day celebrations. Most streets were empty as soldiers tried to control entrances, entrance places rather, like Mombasa's old town. Despite the fact that there were no reports of major insecurity incidences across Mombasa, many people were forced to remain indoors because they were afraid of the soldiers. Even though it was a happy day for most people, some residents who broke the law by using roads that were alleged that were closed rather were allegedly forced to swim in sewage now Mwang Mwangole Chikore was accosted, accosted by the military officers in mass and forced to swim inside a sewer for about 10 minutes now mr. Chikore a 23 year old salesman from Mwembe Tayari said he was on his way to Mashuja Day celebrations when the soldiers stopped him and demanded to know why he was looking suspicious all right, so where Mangis, I'm gonna start with you on this one. So, Mashuja, una jotu president akienda mali lazima security ya so salama lazima ilinde. So aso mombasa, ukongo tu kitembe akunenyol kalisho kama tope. <laughs> Don't go anywhere. 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 do Tafadhali. <laughs> and you know, kama usha yenda passing out, wacha hata hii, hii ni hii likuwa shadow. Hii yenda passing out, uone, kuna kwa gana baithe puli yeyo kazi. It's there. It's there. Ask the soldiers, they'll tell you. It's part of their style. That's right. their lifestyle. Hiyo ni kuwaga, by the way, for the record. Ni kuwaga ubakishe meno. It's okay. So, whatever they were just doing, it was just their way of discipline. Yeah. So Eo ni wameshazo ya. Eo ni kawaida. Ni kawaida. Kwa mwalimu wa sikupige kiboko. It's normal for them. Mm-hmm. That's their way of life. So to swallow. That's a. Chini watu walifunga wa milango. Watu walika indoors. Waliko. Uko. Unajua ziko hapa. <laughs> Rezo kwa hapa but unawenea kwa TV. Unajua watu kukundie. <laughs> Siwenda tulikuwa home. We had yeah. a better view. Yeah. Kuliko wasi wanyo likuwa huko. Yeah. Because. Uko kulikuwa kutriki. Utembe ovi ovi unaka suspicious ndani. Usijuu unaka aje ndani. Sijuu nini umeogelea kwa matope. Yeah. Just stay safe. If yeah. you know you look like a suspect kama watu wengine I'm not mentioning names. Tafadhali usitembe ovi ovi. At the same you have you like kitu na suma kwa tuwa wengine. I've seen that. I've, that has happened to me before. And right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in Jaguar, mm -hmm. took a strike, mm -hmm. and uh, it's it's too violent. So Jesse mm wakakuja. -hmm. Na kulikuwa na those who've been to Juja na Juja yapo getsi pa kwa nayo mtaro kwa ngana magic ever. So mimi na bishi yangu tumia kuja mesle alikuwa mbwa kwanza chosen ya white mora I. Tulikuja tu kambiwa ata ilikuwa ata si aku na kunegoshiyeti. Wow. She tried to explain, oh, Sijui Nini, I'm pregnant. Na, 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 na. Dani. Unaingia, 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 unatoka. Utaitolia kwa mai. Wewe, ukiingia, ukitoka, wewe, enda huu, sasa. Wewe, 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 So, it happens. Haya, mtu wameona video za, za karawa kitrain, mm -hmm. training yao. Matope, matope. Inakuanga ni punishment. Mm -hmm. Ata, kunanga kuongelelea wako, tunarol, tunu, unamuka na injiu, move on with yeah. life. So, afulu, ni ndani, ndani, ndani. <laughs> 
Like okay before even say anything. I flew shay patikana. Una je easy my operation. Siju mjua libiwa simu. Siju what happened? Yes, tell us what happened. Ile leru ni nakuanga refu. Au pandangi atina mguu. Una panda kama umeruka ndani. Kwa sababu ya hiyo juu ya mtu chukua time una kongo hapo chini. Na bado uko juu kuna mtu ananya huu. So unaingia hapo umeingia. Una dive. Kitu ya pili yenye Kenya sisi ndo kusikiza opposite. Mm-hmm. Usikojoe hapa. <laughs> Lakini una kutamka najiuliza ha, huyu mtu anasema nisikojoe hapa. Kwani hapa kuna nini? Mm-hmm. Wacha nijaribu nione. Hapo jo once msame ameshajichota tu mwenyewe unakuta amefanya kitu kai. Eh, hawa watu hawapi pia shughuli yao. <laughs> Soldiers. <laughs> hey, jamaa, si ni wa Kenya man. Mtu urumie za zingine. Kusimu kwa sewage. <laughs> Jamani, simu kipate tendi ya notion tukua tunasimu tunafiko kuchini seven feet tunarudi. Hey. Wewe unaweza? Nani? Waambie usimu ndio nosha 7 feet. Eh hey, hapa mshaosha. 7 feet. Sasa kama inshallah. Sasa ni kwa experience. Tunamaanisha hivi sio hivi. Hivi across. Si deep. Hivi. Ana usimu naro. Unapita across. Hata kusimu ndio. Eh hapa mingi sana kulikao. Shaba taujui. Anyway, 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 I mean, uh, like, sorry, what affect you, my name, Paul? That sounds like really awful. It doesn't sound like a nice thing. Now, the hashtag is white for updates. Why one of the victims have you ever been found in such a situation? We'd love to sample some of your comments, right? But let's move on to another story. Now, a renowned Tanzanian singer, Harmonize, who came from rags to riches, has launched a food truck branded Konde Boy. Uh, the say truck will allegedly be supplying free food for the next six months six months rather to the less fortunate within his hometown the singer took to social media expressing his joy at having finally actualizing the dream all right so kind of boy they call me papa. Ah, sasa, so, so, uh, what's your... <laughs> what do you party after party? Yeah, uh, okay, so uh, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough. All right, so, coin the boy. Harmonize, yeah? He just launched a food truck. He has supply him to all the food for the next six months. Is it a PR stand? Um, is it, okay, he called it his dream. Like, he said uh, growing up, he didn't have a lot. Like he, he, they used to sleep with like like without eating most times. No, because una jo kunelo ne zalala juju lelo si diski kukula. Paina la kunata kaka kukula uko lanza, but there's no food, there's nothing. So he said he's been through that and he knows how bad it gets. So now that he's blessed, he can bless his people. So I'm a lunch. Kunata kupika, kunata track in enda round mtaani ukiskianza. Like inu alonya ana ajuwezi. So for everybody, wala ajuwezi, and then you get food. Yeah. Uh, you get your meal for the day. Then is there's two ways you can look at this uh, story. Mm-hmm. One way is that I will call it a pure PR stunt. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, it's a noble cause. Right. The problem is one: how do you know who's needy and who's <laughs> not? That's why I'm calling it a PR stunt. Yeah. He just left, I think, Wasafi recently. Mm-hmm. He's now a lunch code boy. I'm mm-hmm. sure he's having his own record label after this. Right. Which is going no, to be he actually a, has. It's, it's his, right? Yeah. Now, you know, um, in, in Tanzania, and I'm sure also here, mm-hmm. for, you, for your music to make it, it has to appeal to everyone mm-hmm. across all platforms. An initiative, a uh, giving back uh, scheme. You're going to have the uh, donors, you're mm-hmm. going to have the government, you're going to have the middle and the high class. At the same time, you'll be affecting the low class and the poor in, this, right. in the system. So he'll have affected everyone, and in the process, everyone will be talking about Conde Boy. Conde Boy. I, don't, I think that's also a nice strategy, given that, like, Umetoko Asafi, you yeah. know, Diamond is like our uh, editor Simba. So living up to him, you know, now he's yes. competition. He's competing with him, which is yeah. a good thing. So, Competing with someone like Damon, you you have to you have to have your own strategy. The big guns, you bring out the big guns. True, true. Yeah, Jesse. I think it's good. Already, the fact that he's helping, it's yeah. okay. It doesn't matter if it's a PR stunt. Mm-hmm. Those people, when you're talking about mekula, when feed on that food for the six months. Yeah. But what happens to people after six, after months, six months then? <laughs> let's let's wait till then. Mm-hmm. To watch a too much. Uh, Judge. Pes- 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 
Tu achie, tu achie hafu. Yeah, ju ata. <laughs> yeah, wacha tu achie hiyo kamati ninakuanga hafu lu. <laughs> so, let's just wait. Then again, it's a good stunt. If at all, amepata attention. Paka Kenya. Yeah, <laughs> 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 Okay. Y254 Imagine Right, welcome back. Thank you so much for staying with us. Now the hashtag is watch for updates. Keep talking to us. It's Entertainment Thursday. We're all about trending topics. We're letting you know what's happening in the entertainment industry. Now, poverty and lack of employment among the Kenyan coast is now allegedly forcing residents to rent out their spouses to reach tourists for some income. According to a report by Hivi Sasa, one tour guide by the name James Kimani says that it began when a tourist asked for his help to get a Kenyan woman with whom, with whom rather he wants to spend his time with in Kenya and due to poverty he handed over his wife. He says he passes his wife as his sister and sometimes she's gone for more than two months but she brings home more than 40,000 a month and he is still in love with her. Now Kilifi County Police boss Patrick O'Kerry confirmed that having a knowledge of the same adding that it has grown to an extent that some women even have two husbands. A European one and their original Kenyan husbands. Where maze ni kubaya economy uchumi mwangiz. Mbona na afuluwa kika kufanya hivi. Kinyata dai. All right, bana All right, so <laughs> Wow. What's going on at the coast, yo? Like, you'll rent out your wife for that period. Some say you could for two months. Or anakala bibi yako akienda na wachia hela, lafu nyum na survive, mnangoja mungine. Sound and that's and it's not even one person. Like it's something that started. Like that's just one person who gave out uh, his theory. A lot of other people are like that. Nata say like mukuba police can confirm. Like you know. Like it's actually true, it's happening, yeah. <laughs> so you have like um, a husband, you're married to your husband, but na husband, you vacation and you, your brother and sister, akishia your back to being married. <laughs> what? If MCK was Apo here, tumefika? angesema mm -hmm. illiteracy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But actually, it's it's actually a very it's 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 something that uh, whoever is concerned about the economy of this country should not be taken lightly. It should not be actually a laughing matter for them. Yeah. yeah. Because when you see people doing that, making 40,000 a month from a wife, and I'm not saying that's small money, yeah. how do you give out your wife Yeah. for a salary? At the same time, mm -hmm. you're giving out this wife, and you're saying you love the wife. So it means she goes, comes back, and when she comes back, she's still your wife. So if yeah. it is about conjugal rights, manza ukoapo. The same pot. Yeah. Uh, just because of the money. 
Yeah, but there's can nothing. Imagine, according to them, there's nothing else to do. You there's see, no any other source of income. There was a report that was actually given out mm -hmm. about the levels of uh, HIV yeah. in the coast. Mm -hmm. It's very high. Yeah. And uh, I saw another report, like, even young girls are doing that. Up to, ones. like, na report, it's, it's so crazy. Up to 13 years. Even nine. There was nine in that list. Yeah, nine years. Nine years. It's that bad. And there are, like, over 13,000 girls. That's it's, what... it's really bad. The economy is not good for us. Yeah. Whatever is going on, coast province or coast uh, region should be actually the, the place yeah. where they're benefiting from everything. Mm -hmm. But now... The people who but are they are port Yes, port yes. Uko. Yeah. Tourism, mm -hmm. every foreigner. They have an ocean, yeah. fishing. Every foreigner, yeah. 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 Right. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. So, so Jesse. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Jesse. Oh, what are your comments? It's sad. It's sad, right? It's sad. Mm -hmm. Considering we in Africa, our traditions, mm -hmm. they don't allow us to do such. Yeah. Gender. Let us do any semen. You see gender based violence, we keep in agreement. Yeah. But then again, morals. Yeah. How will I come tell my husband? And the hey, kids? Babe. What do you tell Leo, kids? Leo, 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 may make. 40k, um, say, I wanna do, you know. I'm um, say, a linear chair 20k. No, I'm it's not, no, 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 it's right not, guy. it's not the woman who goes looking, it's has been done at a foot, and a Yeah, yeah. And how, 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 how you does this wife say no, yes? Honor, Utaku Jaji, at a Nikwambie, in a leo, um, say, a liquid in a view, no, Tuna, and living in the under the same roof. At the yeah. The husband and your protagonist. So our mm. say wanakuja and I save on pesa accommodation. Yeah. Unampikia. So if he's here for three months, Unamfulia. Unakuwa bibiake for three months, yeah. and your real husband is walking around as your brother. As your brother. Yeah. Ume chika your reason ni juu umtu anishi kwa inyumba. <laughs> All right. Hope you, I hope you will have something Gosh. stupid to say. Please pass over to a real man. A real man. What's your new opinion? Okay, so a real man. Mm -hmm. industry is easy. My industry moves easy na fungwa. Yeah, but that's true. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Eh, tu kujau kuinge. Kila mtu hana. Yani pesi me kwa kama virusi. Kila mtu hana. Kila mtu hana. Oko na yo. Hi Joshi. To me, let's place you may put a boss to uh, ah, ah. No, 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 it's my point. It's a full <laughs> point. Kamati ro chafu. Let's man yonge. Right, uh -huh. It's a high time my youth go in here. Because kuna sewa tu mevijana yungi wako kwa mawe sayo wa meka. Hawa na kitu. Mm -hmm. No, no, what's oh, expect? Yeah. Nishike mtu shingo, nitoe pesa. It's a man wife. Wife yako kama an opportunity. Peana. Kama hawezi, See. wachana na hai. Ni agreement, ni agreement. Nyo nye mkele wana nye pesa kuna kwa hii nyumba. Elo wana hindi kakuna kitu. Hapana. Aje. No. Alright. Sawa. So, so that is... Ni kwa nyo watona pesa walisumbua hivi kichwa. No, no. Sawa. No. no. We're not going to talk about... Nyo nyo wana tuko kazi. Sia ni pekenyu. Sawa basi. Sawa. Sawa. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's Sisi wote. Let's agree to disagree. Right? Yeah. We're going to talk about this. Bez. Tuko na bez. Yekwangea. Badae. Sawa. Oh now, residents of Migari village. Now, this is a nice story. This one I like. Residents of Migari village in Taraka, Nithi County have built a house for a man after 16 years of living under a huge rock. Mr. Anderson Mu... Mchunku, 57, has been living under the rock since uh, um, his house collapsed, with the only protection from the sun and the rain being a polythene paper. All right, so this guy has been living under a rock, maze. Kwa jiwe for 16 years. Nyumbaki liyanguka 16 years ago. So, the brother promised he's gonna build a house for him. Alaf pia brother ke vitu azikuanda vile zilifa, so he didn't also have money. So, akamambia tu angoje. Squila vitu zita happen, alafa tamjangia. And then that never happened. So, the re residents have been looking at him, especially during the rainy season. They're like, hey, maze, this guy is suffering. Najwa aibi mtu, aendi ya tikuomba malipa kulala. He's just like been living there. So, they're like, you know, I think it's high time we come together and do something for him and then they built him a house just when i had lost all hope in humanity then good people out there monkeys yes it's, it's really touching Look, you know no, 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 no emotions that's nice I, I, i'm happy that they really decided mm -hmm. to do that mm -hmm. 16 years is actually such a long time 
but whatever they did, um, it was due. Mm -hmm. I'm sure, okay, I really hope mm -hmm. that it is not anyone mm -hmm. Ati ya metoka na uko, amekuja kuitawasewa jenge, alafu 2022, aseme ati nilisaidia kufanya kitu fulani. No, it was not political, really actually. No, no this is the, res the residence. Yeah. Residence? No, we know how these things go. Mm -hmm. We really hope that this guy got it from the people. And yeah. if it's that, it's very compassionate, mm -hmm. it's very nice. People should do that, embrace it. We really love it. And people should continue doing that. Waendele na moyo huo huo. Na moyo huo huo. Na sande sa. Should I, is that something that other communities should borrow from? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I think it's so touching. Yeah. Honestly, it's so touching. Right. It's Especially if you look at yeah. him. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's still shows yeah. there are good people out there. Yeah. Not just squeeze the world has been so unfair. I told you who to trust and who right. to trust. Mm -hmm. And the fact that no no msana can mpaka nikani enzi za maumau ama mnyie muone anakaa dio hiyo picha anakaa kama ame amekaushwa hapo yeah and okay we, okay we are in na sauti kidogo <coughs> aki nimekuwa emotional Let's get that for you. Why? Great. It's sad, but it's a good thing. Yeah. You know, you touch the fact that some people came through wakam mm. jenge a nyumba. Yeah. It's a good thing. Aki, right. can it be residents big up to make sure you enjoy, man? Yeah, but Aki that was nice. Uh, right. So the main challenge is that I'm mm. gonna I'm gonna nyumba, but since mm. uh, she died, it's gonna be food. So if you interact with anything, man, uh, find this guy and just do something uh, for him, right? Yeah, All right. Happy you. Come out here, Rocha. I hope you are gonna have a good comment this time round. Tenda mema, nenda zako. Iyo tu nenda sema. Oh, that was nice. Hey, nice and girl. easy. Hey. We love it. Hey. Well, like, no, I think like he's actually genuine about what he's supposed to. Hard go. Right now, because of time, because of time, let's move on to our other. So actually, this is our last story. Unfortunately, <laughs> now <laughs> Nicki Minaj has confirmed that she secretly married boyfriend Kenneth Fatty this week after less than a year of dating. The rapper tied the knot quietly on Monday, even though most of the social media users don't like her choice of a husband for having been convicted. Uh, for having been convicted before. So, Nicki Minaj and uh, Petty are finally married. <laughs> like, Minajua, are you happy? Kamacha Rochafu, Nicki is finally married. Boy, child. Eldoret. Okay, so most people have a problem with Fati because of in uh, Kitambo, in June 1996, he was, con he was convicted of, uh, he, he was arrested for like four years of uh, attempted rape. He apparently raped someone, like a jela, like a toka, sijui, he was GP accused of sijui, and he told me she jela jela. So finally, guys are like, no, the guy's been yeah, in jail, you shouldn't be with him, you cannot trust him. Do you think Nikki made the right choice? Yeah, she made the right choice. Mm -hmm. Everyone in this world deserves a second chance. Mm -hmm. Kill him too. Mm -hmm. He only like, how many years ago? This is my opinion here, uh -uh. Mm -hmm. boy. Right. So, <laughs> uh, he deserves, he deserves a second, a second chance, chance as a human being. Right. In total, I'm to Mahali. Mm -hmm. Nikki Pia, and I deserve, and it comes handy. Ni choose it to me say Nikki I'm a quit music. See, I listen to Yeah, to start a family. Yeah, now to make fun of some artists. Nikki, my Mugabe, the only one I'm going to take a mystery. You only quit the same time after. Nakumbuka, we get after Mugabe and pass. So this is it. It's a good thing. I'm so happy for her. It's almost every woman's dream. Tiger not. So and this one, this Nikki one. and uh, Ken mm -hmm. dated back in the day. Yeah. So then come on, they rekindle they rekindle yeah, their rekindle. life. Yeah, yeah, they rekindle <laughs> their life. Yeah. yeah. All right, Dennis Mongis comments foopy foopy. We all have time. Very happy for the boy child involved. <laughs> Very happy. I'm a fan of Villa or Twengi or Natakanga. I'm a fungu and I like to kill him to Natakanga Kufungu and Ayo. I go sour to the girl child. Yeah. I'm supporting Afolo on this one. What a kosala do? You don't want a kosala. You know I'm so. I am so. What? Who the Nikki? 
I cannot believe what you panel you are saying. Why are you negative like this? No, the Nikki. Nikki or Kiki. All right, so let's do this. Last, let's give the last remarks and your social media pages as we go because unfortunately we always run out of time. All right, Dennis. Yeah, I go by the name Dennis. Mm -hmm. uh, she, she, that's my cousin and Kevo. They were having their birthdays yesterday and oh, today. Oh, happy, happy birthday. Mm -hmm. It was their birthday. See you, Ayako. I, I, I Ouch. <laughs> 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 All right, <laughs> continue. As I was saying, Phyllis, Sarah, Moas, you guys have always been supporting me. Kuna sawamu kenyash wa mta. Actually, nilipata na kenyash. Kani ambu sponi big up. Tuna kosana kenyash back at home. Big up and uh, always keep tuned. Uh, Add it next week to one another. <laughs> All right, Jesse, the sassy. Yeah, uh, let's guys, uh, everyone, at our upper panel, mm -hmm. let's bring back humanity. Right. Mm -hmm. I think your kitu CJ guzo kwa panel la story kama yo. Mnajua literally, ni vile tu ni avoid. Okay, you're gonna balance machos yeah, easy. I was man. like, ah, yeah, you're gonna cry? Yeah, yeah I almost yeah. did. Shit, yeah. Shit, yeah. Shit, yeah. Shit. Wait, wait, okay. <laughs> we cannot be kids right so, now. Kenny, we don't have time. Okay. Yeah, just see Mogura Facebook, just see Mogura Instagram, and Mogura Moresha Twitter. Thank you so much, guys, for tuning okay. in. We love you. Yeah, what are you Baby oh, L, Baby yeah. L, Ali, come. Thank you. All right. Happy. Squeeze your Twitter and imagine I'm busy. Oh, okay. Ata sio kita mama mtu we mama utakosana. Sasa kila mtu ni bebe. Call me the only general of Fulu Imboko. Twitter only at Fulu Imboko, Instagram ni Fulu Imboko, Facebook page ni Fulu Imboko. Tafadhali Nick Minaj, mimi naombea tu msikosane. Mhm. Tafadhali. I know you Nick Minaj. Mtakosana tu. Mikiki <laughs> all right unfortunately that's all the time we had and we have to go a big shout out to everybody that was tuned in a big shout out to all of you guys that were tuned in we appreciate each and every one of you now the show ends right here but it doesn't have to end stay on the hashtag white for updates if you have any stories you want us to talk about next week make sure you tag us and we'll be more than glad to share that on this show and a big shout out to everybody who made the show possible all the camera guys there Faith right there on sound, Yvonne TC, we have Biggie, I can, Elvo, like uh, Milton, our uh, Heavy and the Beast uh, in studio, uh, Yvonne, a big shout out to you as well, Timor, hey, my director, a big shout out to all of you, by the way, everybody who made this possible, we appreciate you. Uh, DJ Club One. Yeah. All right, now, we're going to do this, uh, so enjoy your weekend. Now, before I go, here's your plan. If you don't have a plan on a Saturday, I'm going to give you a plan. I'm going to be having an event right here at Ru 104 in town. Amazing bands. We have uh, performances. Charges, charges are just 500. Bob, follow me at Feeling Gin to find out more information, and then we can catch up and have a great day. Not day. <laughs> Time. For now, it's bye and good night, and we'll see you next week. <laughs> Enjoy.